This song is a favorite of carolers and choirs at Christmas, but it was despised by one of the most famous fictional characters in history. The song, God Rest Ye Merry Gentlemen, is a traditional song whose origins are unknown. Certainly its bright melody and staccato rhythm has made it the perfect song for carolers and a cappella singing groups. Of course its lyrics, which tell the main events of the Nativity story, also contribute to its popularity. While we may not know who wrote the tune or the lyrics to God Rest Ye Merry Gentlemen, we do know that Charles Dickens wrote about the song in his literary classic, A Christmas Carol. In this story, a young man appears to the miserly Ebenezer Scrooge, attempting to cheer him with a Christmas carol. God bless you, merry gentlemen, may nothing you dismay. Then, according to the story, Scrooge seized the ruler with such energy of action that the singer fled in terror, leaving the keyhole to the fog and even more congenial frost. Of course, it wasn't long before the ghosts of Christmas past, Christmas present, and Christmas future visited Scrooge, melting his heart of stone into one of compassion and kindness. And by the end of the story, not only was Scrooge able to wish others a Merry Christmas, but it was said that even his own heart laughed. He found the redemption and joy found in the first stanza of the famous carol. God rest you merry gentlemen, let nothing you dismay. Remember Christ our Savior was born on Christmas Day to save us all from Satan's power when we were gone astray. O oh, tidings of comfort and joy, comfort and joy, O oh, tidings of comfort and joy. As you sing this carol, maybe your song too will reach the most hardened Scrooge and bring a merry heart to someone you know this Advent season. As Dickens said at the conclusion to his story, Keep Christmas well, and may God bless us, everyone.